Equity in conjunction with East African Business Council, Minnesota Africans United, Global Minnesota, and Prosper Africa hosted delegates attending a U.S. trade mission to Tanzania and Kenya. The delegates, representing various institutions in corporate America, engaged with over 500 entrepreneurs through panel discussions, business networking sessions, and site visits to businesses in Dar es Salaam, Zanzibar, Nairobi, and Naivasha. Welcoming the delegates in Dar es Salaam, Equity Group Director, Corporate Banking, Rafael Onyango, said that equity has purpose to champion the recovery of Africa from the effects of the COVID-19 pandemic. Equity as a Pan-African bank has purpose to champion the sustainable building of African continent through implementing the Africa Recovery and Resilience Plan which is a social and economic transformation plan that aims to capacitate, connect and coordinate and finance African economies in order to transform Africa's wealth. Tanzania Private Sector Foundation Director for Policy, Advocacy, Zaki Mbena, said that the interactions are critical for knowledge exchange on the needs of the immediate market and the global trends. Equid Bank, in a very special way, have come out for the first time with an open economic plan for resilience and recovery. Most banks or financial institutions at such moments, the traditional way is actually to have under the carpet strategies of sustaining their own businesses and not even sharing what opportunities are. But that has not been the case with equity. An effort is really about where you put your heart and your soul. It's really about, do I really want to create an opportunity for someone here on Earth? And that's one of the reasons why the U.S. government, Tanzanian government have been working together and the Equity Bank to see how we can advance economic uh, opportunity between the two countries. During panel discussions, various Tanzanian entrepreneurs shared their views on the local business operating environment and opportunities for trade and investment. As American Chamber of Commerce uh, in Tanzania, we really appreciate this uh, delegation coming from US and the efforts of the Equity Bank. Uh, we believe that this will lead to uh, more business opportunities and collaboration between uh, both Tanzania, Kenya and US companies. The delegates visited Kigamboni City College of Health and Allied Sciences to learn about training of Tanzania's labor force. The bank of equity has been a very important part of us. It has financial facilities for us, like COPO, the account that has been used and the work that has been used. We have been able to help us with the hospital. At Galco and GSM Group, near the port of Dar es Salaam, the delegates learned about Tanzania's role as a key logistics and freight service hub, given its strategic position. Equity is one of our key partners, and uh, they've uh, facilitated uh, procurement and facilities that have actually allowed us to grow to this magnitude. But their presence in multiple countries within the region has allowed us to bank easily and move uh, our money whenever we've had to. Tanzania being a developing country, we believe that uh, there's still need of uh, investors to come in. The delegates also paid a visit to Zegereni, the designated industrial area in Kibaha district in the coast region of Tanzania. They toured Kairuki Pharmaceuticals Industry, the first commercial intravenous fluids manufacturing plant in Tanzania. Equity Bank is a regional bank in, in, the, in the East Africa. They've got a lot of clients whom they can get be connected with and start business. I mean, at least you can use that leverage to, to find out who are the big players in those markets. After the sessions in Dar es Salaam, the delegates took a two-hour boat ride to Zanzibar, an island off the East African coast renowned as a tourism destination. At the official opening of the Zanzibar leg, the Minister of State President Office, Labor, Economic Affairs and Investment, Mudrik Sora, said that Zanzibar was adversely affected by the COVID-19 pandemic, which brought to light the need to diversify to other economic sectors. Our sincerest of gratitude 
to Equity Bank for continuing to express their interest working together with the government in pursuit of economic prosperity and development and moving our economic agenda for the island. Equity Bank Tanzania Managing Director Isabella Maganga said Equity is working with the government of the United Republic of Tanzania to promote the nation as a destination that is ripe for trade and investment opportunities. Equity has purposed to champion the sustainable building of African continent through implementing the African Recovery and Resilience Plan. This plan is a social economic uh, transformation uh, that aims to capacitate, to connect, coordinate, and finance the Africa economic value chain. There are at least two principal areas in which a trade mission like this with equity is useful. One, of course, is the immediate connections that may bring investment or may bring business opportunities where you can meet a potential client or investor. The other is the fact that there is something about being on the ground or talking to experts about a market that tell you what the situation is, be it energy or, or anything else, that you just don't necessarily get from background reading. In panel discussions, various stakeholders discussed investment opportunities and trade opportunities in the island, including the blue economy, real estate, energy, tourism, hospitality, and infrastructure. We have even now improved our facilitation, improved our services in terms of providing permits. Investment certificate can be issued within 24 hours political will is there, the capacity of our people who are dealing with facilitation and service are there. In 1995 we had around 20-25 uh, hotels, tourism hotels. Today, 2022, we have 650 hotels on the island. We were employing around 2,000 people at the time. Today we are employing directly into tourism around 80,000 people. So you can see how tourism is growing. There are a lot of other opportunities on tourism. The delegates visited Fumba Town and the United Petroleum Refinery Depot to explore investment opportunities in real estate and in the energy sector respectively. Equid Bank has able to brought a lot of our business, uh, our private sector in Tanzania, the business people, and then the connection were great. And then uh, we had a lot of information. They provided with the resources that we need so that we can bring the tourists to this beautiful country of Tanzania and the island of Zanzibar. Tanzania is set to be, to be positioned in the global economy. The trade mission in Tanzania is among the many initiatives that Equity Group, through its regional banking subsidiaries in six countries, has put in place to accelerate the implementation of the Africa Recovery and Resilience Plan. The aim is to champion the sustainable building back of the African continent post the COVID-19 pandemic.